Alrighty, Canyon Chris here. I am done uh, running these tailings through the Gold Hog concentrator. And uh, normally, you know, if there's any gold, you're going to see it like right on top. You'll see little pieces and stuff like that. And this is my tailings, you know. Uh, nothing. I mean, if, if there's anything, it's down deep or I'll have to uh, run it through the washer mat and uh, then go to a, a pan and then I'll see if there's any 200 mash pieces or whatever but uh, you know I think I think Saturday uh, when I was operating my uh, Gold Hog uh, uh, mini multi banker I think that thing got, got like all of it man I think it got all of it and that's a good sign and if I don't have this is my tailings. If I don't have any gold, hardly in anything in here, then um, then I had it tuned right and I was it was doing uh, uh, its job. But all of these mats here, all of these riffles are different. There's different capture zones, and they're all shaped differently. If a if a piece of gold doesn't like one here, it'll keep going down, keep going down until it finds a riffle that'll hold that particular piece of gold. Flat gold tends to float down. Uh, tiny little coarse pieces of gold. Normally, if you've got any, they're going to be in your first couple of riffles right, right in here. So now I do have uh, from my uh, mat on uh, the uh, piglet. I do have a, a concentrates uh, from that mat that do, does have the gold out, out at in it. Excuse me. So. Uh, I'll be running that through uh, through this through this uh, not this mat here but through the cleaner mat. All right, so so far so good. Canyon Chris over and out.